Today, Kevin and I are trying two dessert items from M&S. I have the M&S Cake Bar Trio, and I'll tell you what those are in just a minute. And mine is the Rocky Road, or White Rocky Road Bites. And these just look evil. Ooh. I do not know how much these were. These were bought at M&S, which is a uh, store. Uh, we bought them in London, uh, but they have them uh, in uh, the United Kingdom. Um, it's a really good grocery store. It's one of my one of my very favorite grocery stores. So, um, but I saw these at the checkout, and they just look really, really good. Yeah, the so, Let's try this one. Let me see if it says. It says it has um, uh, sultanas, marshmallows, cherries, crisped rice, and biscuit pieces in uh, coated in white chocolate. I like all that stuff. All the, it has a lot going on, doesn't it? Oh, and I should say the calories are. Uh, 465 probably if you eat the entire package, I would say. No. Yeah, you can see. And I will have to take a picture of these because they're really pretty, and I think that's what attracted me to them. Um, let me see if I can hold one up because it, you can see the cherry. Her bite is 47 calories. It's 47 calories each, okay. basically. But if you eat the whole container, it's going to be half of 465. So it's going to be oh. 230 so, something. Okay. So 230 if you eat the whole package. They do their calories different. Sometimes they say the actual calories in the package. Sometimes they don't. The marshmallow throws a strange texture in there. Mm-hmm. Not bad, it's just different. That's just okay for me. Did Not bland you? enough. Mm -hmm. I get the cherries and I get a little bit of the white chocolate flavor, but that's about it. For all that it has going on, it really is plain. Get a little bit of raisin. I mean, you're getting all the flavors out of it. I'm mainly getting the sultana flavor. Yeah, but it's not like... Ah. Yeah, it's not like everything is... It's not as powerful as you think it would be. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Those are okay. They're okay. I, if I was if I was to shop at M and S, if we lived there all the time, I would no, not buy those mm -hmm. again. I wouldn't. Um, and you do get a little bit of white chocolate too. Mm -hmm. You definitely get the flavors. Mm -hmm. That marshmallow in there throws you off a little bit because you're chewing it. It's kind of like this rubbery feel inside there. Yeah, it's like oh, this is different on my teeth mm -hmm. from everything else that's in here. It's not bad, just not my favorite thing from mm -hmm. M and S. No, there's either. much better things to buy at M and S. This is the um, Cake Bar Trio. It is a, um, a lemon meringue, raspberry flapjack, and millionaire shortbread. Now, we have tried the millionaire shortbread from M&S, but I want to try it again. Yeah, I don't remember. Because I do not remember. Yeah, it's been a while. Um, you yeah. should um, take those out, take a picture of them. And then, and then come back. Okay. All right, so I, <laughs> so I took a, I actually took a picture. You'll see four little uh, squares because I took a picture with one of those yeah. in it. So okay. Because I doubt there'll be anything left once we get. Done. Right. Exactly. Um, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna just make a mess down. here. Just okay. So we have the millionaire shortbread. Let's try that first. It's like peanut butter and chocolate. Oh. It looks like peanut caramel, oh, car is a caramel, a biscuit. It looks like a biscuit and caramel and chocolate. Mm, caramel. Um, since it's been in the package with the lemon, it tastes like fruit. Uh, yeah. It tastes like lemon. I agree. It's okay. It's a definitely melt in your mouth kind of thing. It is, but honestly. If you like the millionaire shortbread, I would just get the whole bar of it because they sell the whole bar of it. Yeah, don't mix it. If they had sold the whole bar of these individually, I would have bought them that way mm -hmm. because we had already tried the millionaire shortbread. Um, yeah, if you're if it, it, you, you can't taste it properly at all because you're tasting that that lemon. Yeah. That's all I'm tasting yeah. is lemon. Yeah, I agree. So you, do you want to try the raspberry yeah, next? Yeah, raspberry. Yeah, it definitely took on the flavor of some yes. the fruit in the package. Yes. So this is the raspberry flapjack. Mm. 
Mm. No, I like that a lot. It's okay. It's a little squishier than most of the flapjacks I've tried. Mm-hmm. It's moister, I guess. It is. I would say that ro those raspberries make it moist. Could be. It's good. I wish they it's sold. Not my favorite, but it's good. Sell those by themselves. You know if they sold a whole raspberry flapjack, I would buy them. Yeah. You're okay. For but me. In the M and S's that I was in, I did not see one by itself like that. And so for you, it's just okay. Yeah. Just it's good. very oaty, like most flapjacks, but it has. I think it has more raspberry to it mm -hmm. than oats to it. Yeah, mm -hmm. you can definitely taste the raspberry. I didn't mm -hmm. like the texture was just too squishy. For it me. is squishy. It's it, it is different. Okay. Now here's the lemon. This is more of a cookie. Yes. Got some crispy, like sugary on the top. Mm-hmm. That's really nice. It is, but I was expecting the lemon to be a little stronger, but it wasn't. That's nice. I love that um, that crisp on the top, but I wish I knew what that was. And it's like little sugar balls or something. Mm -hmm. it, is, it is very, very good. I like that. Well, out of the three, the lemon one was my favorite. Uh, mine too. Really? Yeah. I like the lemon and then the raspberry, which I know you probably won't, and then the millionaire just because I couldn't taste the millionaire. Yeah, probably the same thing, honestly, because the millionaire was... They ruined it by putting it in with They the, really the, did. They should have put something, either maybe a, fl a plain flapjack piece, or maybe even one of these. I don't yeah. know. It's something when you add anything to lemon like that, um, or at least they need to have the lemon maybe at the other end of the package. I don't know. Yeah. <clears throat> I agree. They just, they just didn't do it. They need to separate something. They need to separate it. I would... I would recommend you try that if you haven't, because I think that's a good little dessert. Mm. Um, if they make the lemon by itself, eat that one. Yeah, I don't think they do though. I looked for the lemon by itself, yeah. looked for the raspberry by itself, did not see them. You can let me know if you live there in the comments, if you've seen them by themselves. I did not, and we were in a lot of M&S stores. Yeah. Um, these, I would pass on. I would too. Yeah, I, I don't know how much we paid for that, but, but I, I just, I, I won't even finish those because yeah. I, I just didn't like them that much. So um, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Um, we have reviewed a lot of foods from uh, the United Kingdom and we have a lot of food reviews coming up and they will all be under uh, a playlist. I think it's called England Eatables. So if you're into English food, then go to that playlist and you will see all of those. So uh, thanks for watching.